Dr. Fatima Jackson has recently joined the College of Arts and Sciences as a professor of biology. She also serves as the director of the W. Montagu Research Laboratory. I was born and raised in Colorado, and I'm part of that lineage on my father's side of um, African Americans who left um, the slave areas. The town that my family helped to found was a town called Deerfields, because the fields were dear to them. I graduated cum laude with distinction in all subjects. I did a, a, my honors dissertation work at Cornell on uh, the whole zero population growth movement and African American responses to that. And then I went for three years to East Africa and came back, uh, continued my graduate studies at uh, Cornell. And I got my master's in 1978 and my PhD in 1981. I just want to say that I love her. She has so much insight. She knows this material in and out. The W. Montagu Cobb Lab is recognized at Howard University as a unique collection of human skeletal remains. Of almost 700 individuals, most of them African Americans, from the D.C. area, and they're collected from this. Some were born in 1830, and it goes all the way to 1969. This is an actual human fetus. This is probably an indication of lack of dental care. We can take those bones and make three-dimensional models. That way, uh, we don't have to keep pulling the bones out. We can use the models, you know, for research purposes. The Cobb Lab is located in Douglas Hall on the second floor. To make reservations, email Dr. Fatima Jackson at fatima.jackson at howard.edu. Reporting for BJ2 News, I'm Ashley Lewis.